Hello and welcome to Burial, a RPG maker horror game developed by Tokiro Kairu and translated by the Apache Illusion team. Um, I played one of their other games actually quite recently from the developer. It was Devil of the Mirror. You know? I quite liked it, so I guess I'm gonna check out this one too. You know, this game came out in 2014, I believe, originally, but I've only noticed it. Uh, I mean, basically today, the time of recording this, because I believe the the translation team uh, released it very recently, um, as well. You know, so I'm I want to check it out. Uh, I guess the premise is apparently it starts off at a cemetery, I guess. Uh, I don't know what that means, but I guess we'll see. And I guess uh, content warning, by the way, is uh, the fact that uh, obviously this is a horror game, so uh, it probably has, I mean, not probably, but it will, rather, have dark themes, mentions of death, you know, gruesome descriptions, and all that jazz, so <laughs> be forewarned. Anyway, let's start a new game. Suddenly, I found myself standing in front of a gravestone. I was in an accident a while ago. My parents died instantly and I survived with critical injuries, having been rushed to the hospital. I was in complete shock and my memory of what happened right afterwards is hazy. I was attending a funeral a while ago, however. Something strange happened. Right before the coffin should have been brought, the funeral had been put to an abrupt halt. No one's around. What am I doing here? And why was the funeral cancelled? Well, I better go back to the church. With my scarf. I don't know, just... just whenever I see a scarf on an anime character, I mean, especially like an uh, anime boy, <laughs> I guess, I just think of Kaito from Vocaloid. I don't know, this was just like a... It's like an accessory, but anyway. No, get away from me! Oh, what's happening? And now she reminds me of Teto. You know, just speaking of Vocaloid, she reminds me of uh, Utao. Anyway, somebody, please. What are you waiting for? Run! Hmm. What's that? Some kind of ghost? Already? The path is blocked. I guess we'll have to hide in the church. What the hell was that? I mean, you could see right through her, and she was chasing us with a sword. How's that even possible? Yeah, okay, questions later. Thank you. Alright. Save the game, though. Well then, since the road is blocked, let's at least find some place to hide. Right. Ding dong. You know, I remember uh, when I played Devil of the Mirror, there were, mo there were movies that played in the game, but sometimes they were a black screen for some reason. It was mentioned, actually, by the uh, translation team that the movies can sometimes break, but... Oh, let's see. Nani? Oh, ending too? <laughs> what? What do you mean? You just die, okay. I, very similar to the first game, I feel like. It just instantly... <laughs> You, I, I didn't even, like, uh, get a sense of my surroundings yet, you know? I was too busy talking about something else, and I, I instantly died, and there you go. That's ending two already? Alright, I guess that was supposed to be chase sequence. It makes sense. She was chasing. I was supposed to find some place to hide, right? Alright, well, let's let's find some place to hide. I mean, probably something to do with this? Uh, why does this tile have a different color? It looks like a trap door. Maybe we can hide here? It's quite spacious here. It's not pitch dark, though it doesn't seem like there's anybody here but us. Well, it makes sense, considering where we are. But what's this place being used for? By the way, what's your name? <laughs> Who are you? I'm Lily, nice to meet you. I'm Kai. Well then, in such a big place, surely there has to be another exit somewhere. Let's go find it together. Yeah. Are you going to explain the ghost lady, though? No, I guess not. Uh, items, by the way. That's our inventory. Hmm. Can't save, though. I guess 
I mean, what was it? I can't remember. I, I always get mixed up depending on which RPG Maker game I played. Was it this game or the developer anyway? The, the last game I played was it all checkpoints that you can only save at? Maybe I can't remember. I think it was actually. Yeah. Anyway, it won't open. I wonder where the key could be. I only mentioned that one because I definitely prefer saving it from a menu. You know, I rather be able to save the game whenever I want. Anyway, uh, you go over here, on the left. So I guess we're stuck in a church, or at least the basement of a church. I guess seems to be a um, actually I don't know what you call it, mausoleum. Is that what it's called? You know, a bunch of dead people. Uh, shall we save here? Uh oh, I right. okay. There you go. That's the save point. All right, that's the save point. We gotta save it next to the Holy Cross. I wonder what, what was that? Don't worry about it. Well, let's explore some more. And uh, yeah, I mentioned before uh, about the movies. Sometimes they were like black screens, you know, which was annoying because I don't see, you know, obviously when it plays a black screen, I can't really show it as I play it. But uh, I did do some fancy editing, <laughs> you know, at least for me anyway. At my level, in order to put the movies back seamlessly into the into the video, so you don't even notice. Anyway, at, at least in the you know the other playthrough that I did of this uh, of the developer, we do good deeds and help others. We love and endeavor to be loved by others, wishing for happiness, prosperity, and atonement for sins in the afterlife. Hmm. That funeral back then was canceled, but why? Whose funeral was it? Me and my parents were injured in an accident. And we were transported to the hospital. It looks like I was allowed to go to the funeral despite my condition. I suppose that the girl was the reason for the interruption? Left behind, just like me. But hey, I'm really happy now, because I made a friend. From now on, you're my precious friend. Mm, that's a little, I don't know. That's a little forward? We, we just met, you know, but... We, we could be acquaintances, I don't know. But like, best friends already? You know? No thanks. Burial. About the burial. I mean, that's the title of the game. About the catacombs. Hmm. In the year uh, 1x9x, an epidemic broke out. No cure was found and the infected had been quarantined in the catacombs. The worst has been averted. However, the souls of the plague victims could not ascend to heaven and turn into vengeful spirits, that luring even the living into their binding spell. We hereby seal them here. You don't say. What if that girl we saw earlier is a spirit that somehow managed to break the seal? No, that can't be real. Ghosts aren't real in this RPG horror game. Good grief. Yada yada does it. And here I thought churches were calm and nice places. What's this? Prayers to the gods. We believe in the gods. We pledge to fill the world with love and peace every waking day. Gods, plural? That's kind of weird. I mean, I'm assuming this is like a Christian-inspired church. There's only, as far as I know anyway, there's only one god in that religion. Uh, bless us with light and shine upon us. Forgive us our sins and deliver us from evil. Hmm. Let's hope we can find a map here. Well, founded in XX6. This place is sacred and cherished by the gods. By the sun god in the morning and by the moon goddess at night. Okay. Adds tale of time, past, present, and future, time will take away. I'm not really into these kind of things. Hmm. This church doesn't seem to worship, you know, the same type of gods uh, that, you know, a typical Christian church would worship, I guess. Maybe? I don't know. I actually don't know. I have no idea. Mr. Bonnie! What's it doing here? Somebody must have left it behind. Alright, from now on, your name is Mimit, my precious friend! Okay, no, you're just making everyone your precious friend. Even if I told her to leave it, she probably won't listen. I picked up a stuffed rabbit. Good. It reminds me of the stuffed rabbit in Devil in the Mirror. Or Devil of the Mirror? I actually always mix it up in my head. I always want to say Devil in the Mirror. It's actually Devil of the Mirror. Push toy. Good. About grudges! Those who retain lingering regrets in death can't ascend to heaven and stay in the world of living, doing evil, led by darkness that consumes their souls. We possess the power to seal them off, but releasing them is beyond our abilities. 
Only one who conquers death can take you to heaven. Hmm. How about perception? Perception is prone to uncertainty. As a result, everyone experiences mistakes and misunderstandings at some point, and often is a big, uh, you know, conflict point for many plots in movies and video games whenever there's a misunderstanding, you know, and just becomes worse and worse. However, these errors in judgment, a malfunction of the senses, sometimes lead to terrible accidents. If spirits have stronger senses than living beings, who knows how much stronger the effect of such misperception could be? About the Binding Spell It's a wall created by the darkness rooted in the souls of the vengeful ghosts, and not a single living being has ever made it out alive. The ones lured into the spell remain trapped there and eventually become spirits too, and the cycle repeats. Hmm. Oh. Weird. Regarding the two entrances to the catacombs. Hmm. So there's another way out after all. That's reassuring. One is by the altar. I found the other one in the dungeon. Oh, okay. That sounds like a nice place. Found it, 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 found it. Hmm. My friend. What the? The page won't leave my mind. How strange. We need to move on. Okay. You read anything else? I guess I can, but... Isn't that weird? Isn't that weird? Tomodachi? I guess we'll just leave. Well... Hmm. Oh, there's a key there. Was the key there before? Well, I want to save first. After that. I'm not gonna get murdered by some ghosts. Until I save, and then I can get murdered. Because then I won't be set back to him too much. Alright, get this key. That was not here before. How did this get here? Got a key. First key. Hmm. Is this a key to this door? Sorry for using it without permission, but this is a sticky situation. We don't have a choice. I wonder what the drawings on the floor are supposed to mean. Oh, that's my zodiac sign. I'm born in December, and uh, and uh, I can't speak. I'm born in December, a uh, Sagittarius. Sagittarius. It's a horoscope, say, which uh, I mean, it's actually a big thing in Japanese culture. I see it all the time in anime. You know, people make a big deal of horoscopes, but it's quite popular there. There's something written on that. Uh, there's something written on that stone monument over there. Maybe some, something about that door. Come on, let's check it out. You know, you seem pretty happy for someone who was chased by like a, a, like a sword-wielding ghost monster just a moment ago. It's very, I don't know, very optimistic. Mm. What was poured down from the jug? Sacred water or scorpion venom? Hmm. Whispers of the Devil, the Lost Lamb, the Holy Maiden's Prayer. Good and evil, heaven and earth, white and black. Everything that is possible, which way will the scales tip? And... Huh. Okay. These flowers are so pretty. I'll just take one with me. You think now's the right time to take those with you? Seriously? I can't. Oh, well, I guess it's fine if you only take one. Yay, thanks. Okay. And, oh, she has a little white flower. This is right there. For some reason. Hmm. Is this a puzzle or something? What does this mean? I don't really know my horoscopes, to be honest. I think, I mean, twin is Gemini, right? Ah, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know my horoscopes. Okay. It won't open. Three pastors are needed here. Oh, by the way, Lily, you said Sagittarius is in December, right? Hmm. Okay, I think I get it. So basically, each description is mentioning a horoscope, right? Or in the constellation? I don't know. Anyway, uh, second water or scorpion venom. So uh, some kind of jug. Whispers of the devils is the second one. The lost lamb. The holy maiden's prayer. Not sure what that means. And good and evil. La 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 la. That's the scales, I assume. I'm just gonna judge from the pictures. 
I, I assume this jug is this thing right here. It could also be the scorpion, though. I guess Scorpio. Um, I don't know what the second one is, though. Mm. Two... I have to read Roman numerals as well. Uh, two... And then... Uh, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Wait, how does that work? If that's eleven, wait, no, no, it should be ten, right? This is ten, but then how do I insert ten? How does that work? Let's have to. Which one's Sagittarius? <laughs> December is Sagittarius, I guess. Ten, eleven, twelve. I mean, I, I think that's the last one. So Sagittarius is like the bow and arrow, I assume. Hmm. There's the fish. Uh, again, horoscopes are more popular in Japan, so everyone just knows it, I guess. Not me. Um, but how's that work? Like, how do you... Do you just add them? Or... Because if there's numbers with uh, two digits to them, how do you put them in a password that requires three digits? I don't know how that works. And I don't get it. What? Oh my god, this is so complicated. Uh, Alright, so you're supposed to... Okay, well this is hard. So I just looked very briefly at the walkthrough. So I can understand this a lot better. So it's, a, it's not just simply... It's not just simply... Each, you know, dialogue line is one zodiac sign. It's actually more than one zodiac sign. So that's why I was so confused about, because I thought it was three lines equals three digits into the password, or maybe three passwords in a row, but like, I didn't realize it was actually multiple zodiac signs in one hint. So what was poured down from the jug, sacred water, or scorpion venom? And again, this is kind of hard because I still don't know, really know the horoscopes all that well. But I guess it would be jug, sacred water, which is represented by the jug again. And, or scorpion venoms or okay so i think it's like uh it's yeah 211 because you see the jug is represented by two and scorpio is represented, represented by 11 i think and 211 so i can try it there you go uh, and, and I, I was, I did realize that the color coding did mean something. I just wasn't, wasn't sure how it was supposed to be inputted in. I don't know. This, well, this first puzzle is actually incredibly difficult for me. Uh, next is purple. It's shut tight. Hold on. Devil is in the zodiac sign, right? Yeah, you're right. Oh, but then I believe that a star is considered the devil's mark. Just like that small one drawn the goat, no? Okay. That's just an extra hint. Let me look at it again. So yeah, it was it's kind of ambiguous. I was I wasn't sure. <laughs> like I didn't know the one sentence equal like multiple zodiac signs. Anyway, so whispers of the devil, the lost lamb, the holy maiden's prayer. So like these represent three uh, digits, I think. So whispers of the devil, which it would get the game gave us a hint already. Something about like. Uh, like a like a like an animal representing the devil or something. I assume it's the goat or whatever, devil goat or something. The lost lamb, which I assume is uh, uh, the ram, you know, the sheep or whatever. And the holy man's prayers, maybe the doll, you know. I was it Virgil, or whatever. Virgil, Virgil from Devil May Cry. No. So like, it's one four nine. Was it one four nine? I think. Goat, devil goat, lost lamb, which is this thing, and then the, the woman, girl, doll thing. One, four, nine. It was confusing because I thought the hints was referring to one zodiac sign. You know, it was all one related to one thing. I don't know. Anyway, one, four, nine. There you go. Okay. I th I'm getting it. I'm getting it now. It took a while. Yellow. Opposite means pairs, right? Perhaps it's about those twins. I was wondering about that. I just wasn't sure. Was it, was it the fish, the two fishes, or the, or the twins, or the scales? Actually, you know, I I thought it was all related to like one thing, but actually it's multiple things. So good and evil, heaven and earth. 
Okay, that's the first thing. White and black, everything that's opposite. That's the second thing. And then which way the scales tip is the scales, I guess. I thought I was referring to the scales entirely, you know, because I don't know, when I think of the scales, you can put good and evil on both sides, right? Anyway. Getting the over heaven and earth. Mm, white and black and everything that's opposite. I'm not sure, but Libra. Libra it's uh is eleven. No, 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 it's 10, actually. It's uh, the Libra scales. I had to look that up. But, uh, so that's like two digits. So the, the first hint has to be the, fir the only one digit. I guess it would be Gemini? I mean, she even said it, actually. Uh, what was her name? Lily, whatever. So it says it's, it's six, uh, ten, right? Six, ten. It opened. There you go. That took so long. Definitely had to look at the walkthrough very briefly just to get an idea what I'm supposed to enter, you know, as the passwords. Oh, that was a weird ghost thing. So it took a bit. I tried not to, like, directly look for answers, though. I like to figure it out on my own, yeah? For the most part. It's no fun if you're doing, like, uh... <laughs> I guess, I mean, I was, I was going to do like a math homework analogy, but then again, math homework is not that fun either. But, you know, it's kind of look, looking at the back of the textbook, you know, without showing your work. But anyway. Hey, you know, hmm? did you say something? Lily, you strike me as the kind of girl that gets lost easily. That's not true. Besides, you won't leave me, leave me behind, right? Right? Okay. I mean, I don't know, man. If it's, if it's you or me, and someone's life is on the line, I only just met you, so... <laughs> A gem. Why is it here? Oops. I fell off. Lily, could you please help me put it back? Are you really that clumsy? But you removed it so effortlessly. Or effortlessly. Can you just help me, pretty please? How did you even take it out? It came off on its own. But I can't put it back either, you know? Fine. We'll borrow it for now and apologize politely later. Okay, we have a gem though. A carnelian? Is that what it is? Carnelian. Raising. Raising. No, rising and setting. Setting and rising. Keeping the cycle of life and death repeating. But the brighter it shines, the more it dries up the earth. But all the life seeks is. The light of truth that illuminates everything. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, there's a cup there. Do not forget the past. So the star of, the, of hope might shine upon us in the darkness from dusk until, until dawn. To honor the path they've walked, we will not repeat the mistakes of the past, but learn from them in the present and pass on the knowledge to future generations. Okay. Now, there's another gem over here, but it looks like it anyway. You see a very small dot there. Another one over here. One is watching, one is praying, two are guiding. For the breath of all living beings could tread into the earth so they could rush their enthusiasm, enthusiasm into blue skies, while overcoming hardships and eventually meeting their fate from the demise to the new dawn. You know what? There's quite a lot of monuments here. It makes me want to scribble on them. Can I? Sure, go ahead. Of course not. Jeez, I was just joking. Let's just focus on finding weight out here. Okay, I think he was being sarcastic, you know. Doing the anime thing. He's like, sure, go right ahead. Not, you know. I don't know. Uh, the waxing wanes, the waning waxes. Two worlds, light and shadow. But don't let madness overcome you. What is ominous and what is sacred is in accordance with your heart. The light of falsehood that rules the night. I think we're here. Oh yeah, oh no, save point. I didn't even notice. Forgot about you could save uh, in the Holy Crosses. There you go. Alright, we explore the room. You see a gold cup and a silver cup. Anything else to look at? What's this actually? Can I look at this? The light is dim here. I can barely see the letters. Is it a memorial or something? Hmm. No, we don't know for sure. I guess. There's left and right. 
I can also go back where we came from, but I probably think that's a bad idea. So I'll go over here. Hmm. Uh-oh. Is this another puzzle of some sort? Maybe? Hmm. Okay, and this is from this side. I assume this goes back to where we were. It's the right side. And there's a mirror, you know? This is a very familiar looking mirror. Again, Devil of the Mirror, or Devil of the Mirror rather, came out after this game, so... It's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of the other way around. You know, if there's any references. Falsehood and Truth. Off, uh, four, and then Tears and Two Cups. Hmm. Offer is something for... Tears and Two Cups. The something door... Uh, something surface? Hmm. The lighting is dim, and the letters are so faint, I can barely read it. Hey, was the door by the altar concealed as well? I think this room also has some kind of trick. Maybe we should bring here all the stuff we see in the hall. Oh, some hands. Good. Lily, what's wrong? Hmm? Uh, no, it's probably nothing. Let's hurry. We didn't see those bloody hands on the mirror, don't worry about it. Hmm, there's a silver cup. An offering to the knight. Okay, silver cup. And I assume a golden cup, an offering to the morning. And these tombstones probably give a lot of hints. Okay, I, I gotta reread them, I feel like, because I didn't really think of it in terms of a puzzle. It's also these gems. Oh, we have to take all these gems as well. Peridot. Gotta remember, though, Carnelian and Peridot are on these sides. Ah, man, I... Okay, let, hold on. What's the one called? Rising and setting, rising and setting. The light of truth. Okay, so... Carnelian, the red one, is, seems to be related to the sun. Do not forget the pass. Honor the path they want. Pass on knowledge to the future generations. Not sure what that means. Well, this one was one is watching, one is praying to her guiding. Blue skies. Yeah, I don't know. I should. I guess I'll grab them, but I, I'm thinking I gotta remember what these uh, angels mean. Lapis lapalooza. The waxing wanes, the waning wax tools, light and shadow, but don't let madness overcome you. I false out rules the night. So the blue one might be related to the night. Hmm, maybe? I don't know. I don't know if it's positional. I'm looking at the statues as well. Any differences? They do have different poses, but. I'm not sure if they relate to anything. Well, let's save the game. Go up. Hmm. Is that a lantern? I don't remember it being here before. Let's take it with us. Look at the lantern. Got a lantern. Two cups, and then you'll find the door to the surface. Okay. You offer them and then you'll, uh, you'll go forward. Can I can see this yet? I do have a lantern. Surely they could have built it in a more visible place, like above ground. What's the point of building it down here, hidden from human eyes? Yeah, I wonder. I don't know. I guess we can't light the lantern. I guess we don't have lantern oil or a source of flame. I think we can insert the gems above there. Okay, I don't even matter. Okay, I guess it doesn't matter. You just kind of insert them. I thought it was gonna be like a big puzzle or something. You like, gotta pay attention. I don't know. Okay, I'm just offering the gems. Then I offer all of them. Put the cup. Put this cup. Did you hear that? Sounds like some kind of mechanism went off. It was close by, but not in this room. Let's go look for it. Hmm. <laughs> just who's that? Say the game. Also, did the door close on its own or was that just... I don't know, anyway. Something happened. I don't see anything that happened. Anything changed here? Doesn't seem like it. Hmm. Maybe I go back? Oh, there's a key. Picked up a second key. Interesting. What the? 
the air became heavier. Lily, are you okay? Yes. All right, then. What's that noise? We're in trouble. There are no other exits we could escape from. And it doesn't seem like we can reach the surface from here. Lily, run! Uh... Uh... Uh-oh. Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay. Suddenly blood and death. Well, no, this is the wrong way to go. I guess. Uh, go here. So there was a door behind the mirror. Is something wrong? I don't really want to enter that door. Somehow I have a bad feeling that we're being driven deeper and deeper underground. You mean... Remember the two keys we found? I wonder if someone placed them there on purpose. Don't worry, we'll be alright. We've already come this far. Besides, we can't stay here any longer, right? The girl's behind that door anyway, and she's supposed to break in here with her, like, weird... You know, ghost hands and her... Killer statues. Yeah, I know, we don't really have a choice. We, we don't really have a choice. Uh, okay, fine, we'll leave. <laughs> Let's just leave. I wonder if we stay there again, we get another game over? Not sure. I was right about taking that lantern. Kai, are you okay? I'm sorry. We wouldn't be able to, uh, we wouldn't be going through this if I had been so quick to rush into this place. But you didn't save us. Otherwise, we couldn't got that, you know, ending number two, where we just die, I guess. Right? So let's get moving already. Just where does your boundless energy come from? Oh, whatever. Thank you. Come on, let's go. Hmm. I don't know what that is. They have a lantern, though. Hmm. All right. Uh, this seems dilapidated. No one's been taking care of this place for a while, I assume. Maybe burnt as well? It looks like it's been burnt, maybe? I'm not sure. I don't think I can find anything around here. Can you go up there? No. I see no sparkles, so I guess there's nothing important here. So I guess that's it. Go to the right. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, some place, some, some ways we can go here. And go on the left as well. Yep. What about down here? Just checking all my options. And go down here as well. What are these, by the way? I'm not sure what these are. Hmm. Uh, nothing around here, I guess. Just rubble. Anything on the left? Doesn't seem like it. Let's go back. Anything in his room? No? An ominous just have just not have nothing. It just have just be nothing. Rooms with nothing in it. And these things, which I still don't know what they are. I mean, my first thought actually was like one of those weird uh, telescope things, or what? Sorry, are they telescopes or whatever? You know, you put the coin in, <laughs> and then you can look through it for a bit. I guess I don't know what we call them, but I don't think that's what they are. That doesn't make any sense that they would be down here. The wire is tangled too tightly. If only we had something to cut it away. Away. I guess we need some scissors. I don't have any scissors though. Hmm. Now let's explore the left, I guess. Save the game again, just in case. Okay. Nothing here, it seems. Nothing in here either. Just... I don't know. I don't know what this place is. But it seems not very well taken care of. No one's, nobody's been down here, I assume, for a long time. I mean, they mentioned something about quarantining, you know, some plague victims around here. Maybe this was a hospital? I'm not sure. Anyway, what's this? I don't know what this is. It's blocked. I don't think we can move it. 
Huh, no strange. I don't know whether I go from here. Because I think I've explored everything at this point. Hmm. Can I go back up? The door is gone, but it's not like it's disappeared completely. More like it's been buried to the point where it can't be called a door anymore. We should hurry on. That girl might be heading this way. Alright. Mm, I wonder what I'm missing, actually. I don't know. Oh. Wait, what? I guess somebody's walking around. Okay. Yeah, I, I couldn't move, by the way. I was kind of stuck there. And somebody else is moving around. Seems like she's gone. When I heard doors opening, I thought that the girl was about to come in here, but it must have been my imagination. But this room, it's different than it was before. Are we good to go? No, I feel like we should wait here a little longer before moving on. Besides, maybe we could find something useful here. Let's look around. Hmm. Well, I came in a bit earlier. I don't remember seeing bones, though. <laughs> I see bones. Spooky, scary skeletons. And also, this is lit now? So I assume, I guess these are like candles? I guess they're just candle holders? Is that what it is? Let's see. There's more bones. Oh, another lantern. Maybe we should take it too, just in case. Though I wonder what purpose does that girl have in mind. Purpose? Why is she driving us down here? If she needs us to take to uh, break the seal, does she already have a lot of opportunities for, for, for that? There's no way breaking the seal is that simple. On the other hand, she was already outside the church. What exactly was sealed here? Well then, I think it's time to leave this room. I got another lantern, times two. Then nothing else. Oh no, there, there's oxygen, carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, calcium, phosphorus, sulfur, polyatom, sodium, chlorine, manganese, marine, fluorine, silicon. Good. It's the um, the table of elements. You know, zinc, strontium, rubium, lignum, blah 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 blah. <laughs> Medical ingredients? These are human components. Hmm. Somebody was making medicines, most likely. Human components, eh? What do you mean by that? To like make a human? Full Metal Alchemist style or something? Uh, oh, oh, what the heck is that? I thought I saw something. <laughs> is that just me? How was this? I've been put in charge of treating the infected. Well, there you go. The patients and moans continue to reverberate through this dungeon. They lie covered in an overflowing pus that never dries out, with a growing number of wounds rotting and eventually turning black. As death approaches, their bodies stiffen. Their labor breathing becomes more and more frequent. At times, we're so short on food, beds, and medicine, we're clasping our heads in despair, not knowing what to do. We began to move around the catacombs less, not even trying to treat anyone. No, it's useless. All our medical supplies are going to the surface. All the dead bodies I've seen until now, they'll be my... Hmm, the note is cut off. Okay, I guess they gave... I assume they gave up on the patients that were here before? That would be in quarantine, I guess, because of the plague. Of some sort. No comment on the bones, by the way? I guess not. They're just, they're, uh, they're just decoration. Don't worry about it. Let's pick it up. Yeah, I, I saw something here. It's rope. I saw rope. It's interesting. The, the game doesn't give me sparkles anymore, so it's actually kind of hard to tell what I can actually pick up. Can I, for example, can I pick up this chair? No, I can't pick up the chair. I don't know. I don't know what I can pick up. No, I don't want to interact with this again. Hmm. Here, no. Guess not. Alright. Uh, what about that clock? Anything to do with that clock? No? Okay, I'm just, I'm just looking for any kind of thing that kind of sticks out to me, but... Alright, we'll just leave. Save the game. I wonder why this one isn't lit, unlike the rest. 
I don't know. Uh, where do we go now? Uh, a rope, we have a lantern, a second lantern anyway. Hmm. I guess we just explore some more. Until we find something. Is that new? What's this? That's, oh, yeah, yeah, there's more rope. It's more, just more rope. I didn't see these items before. <laughs> Maybe they were hidden in the darkness, or... Maybe someone literally left them here. Talisman. I have a feeling that was hidden in the debris on purpose. Hmm. No, I can't pick it up though. Weird. Well, we got some rope. I don't know where else we can go. I guess we're just gonna, we'll just continue exploring. Find some things that we didn't see before. Maybe. I see more rope, basically. It's just... What's this? I really don't want to touch it, but oh well. Hmm. Give you some essential room? Oh, here you go. I thought, I thought it was more rope, but actually it's something else. It's a note. The box is here. How to open the box? How to open the door? The door is da 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 da. Snuffer? Snuffer, is that a word? S Snuffer for candles? Things for the funeral. You are here and the map is here? Weird. I don't know what that means. What's this? More rope. So, I mean, that's more rope, anyway. More skeletons. And more sounds of somebody walking around. Hmm. Yep. The heck is... What? The heck? Huh. And... Oh, more stuff here. What's this? That bastard locked the door leading the staircase. On top of that, I don't know where my toolbox is. What the hell does he intend to... Hmm? The sentence ends abruptly. So there's a way to the exit behind that door. If we start moving the debris, there'll be a lot of noise. She'll have an easy time catching us in this dead end like mice. A toolbox. We should look for it. I guess that was a note. Also, pickaxes? It's too rusty, though. Shovels. Okay. Anything in here that looks... I can pick up, maybe? Hmm, I thought I saw something, but maybe not. What the? Hmm, I can look inside these, maybe? Oh, if only it could go back in time, I would have never come to this town. Hmm, nothing there, I guess. I wonder what could be the origin of this disease. They told us we should stay in their beds to recover, but... They were wrong. Anyone who rested was still sick. Thus, we're not trying to sleep at all. They don't know how to cure it. That's why we have to pay the price to prevent the infection from spreading. They also have to pay the price to get out of here. Okay. Like prisoners. <laughs> Quarantine, eh? There's a fruit knife inside of it. It's rusty and unusable. Hmm. Hey, how many years do I have left until this disease gets me? A red room bloomed on my bare skin. Its thorns are signs of the curse. Its thorns are signs of betrayal. The needle is an omen of danger. The toll of a bell is a sign of crossing a boundary. It's just like in the old fairy tales. Sleeping Beauty and Cinderella. Another hint, perhaps? Hmm, is that a hint? Is that actually a hint for something? Not sure. I don't know what that means. Red rose bloom on the bare skin. And thorns. Thorns, needles, and bells. Hmm. Hmm. Does this place look different to anyone else, or is it just me? Over here. Nothing in here? I look at these things again. Yeah, I didn't know you can interact with this, I guess. I've been requested to clean this place up, pack up the junk, and move out the bones. Well, there's still a bunch of bones here. So much nonsense is said about this place. Gods, phantoms, you name it. But what's strange? One of the skeletons I found had some talisman on it, and that skeleton was in a better state than the others. I don't know why. But we did see a talisman, actually. We didn't pick it up, though, for some reason. We just left it there. There's several empty bottles in here. Hmm. 
What month is it today? What day is it? I don't know anymore. You see the imprints of the human bodies, by the way, on the beds. Put on your red, red shoes and dance, dance, dance. A lovely present for the dance of death. Oh, joy, oh, joy. Lily shouldn't see this. <laughs> oh, my, why not? You will pay the price to free us from the binding spell, won't you? What? What's wrong? Uh, nothing. Let's move on. I, I don't know why, but I guess I'm being uh, assaulted by thoughts of the beyond. Of the vengeful ghosts in this place, I guess. Do you only pray to God in times of hardship? The amulet's power works, but I wonder what it was protecting. I had a dream. A dream where I woke up and couldn't breathe. Where I felt pain but couldn't move my body. Then I concentrate my consciousness and try to move my body and finally wake up. But it keeps happening again and again. Mm. Okay. I guess that's it. Oh, oh. I thought I saw something. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. I can't can't really do enough of that debris. So go this way. Um. All right, we'll go to the right this time. I guess we gotta get some more items though. We don't, we don't get enough items. I guess something like scissors, needles, or something. I don't know. Let's go over here. Anything in here? Uh, I can't really see, to be honest. Seems to be blocked by something. So, I don't know, actually. I can't really get past. <laughs> Trying to try to move past this way, but I can't. Oh. I'm just stuck. Alright. Doesn't seem to be anything there. Uh, more drawers. And, oh, what's this? I see. Oh, <laughs> what's that? What's this? More rope. All right. Got a lot of rope. I don't really use the rope for it, to be honest. A year. Constellations. Time. Twelve is one wor world. Let twelve be ten. So when the Grim Reaper comes, the world could die and be reborn again. What's this? A half-baked password? What do those numbers mean anyway? Hmm. Twelve. Uh, was it ten become twelve? Or twelve be ten? Twelve be ten. All right. Okay. My wish did come true, and my love has just gone, just like that candle. If only I could become sea foam, but this wish also won't come true. Instead, now I'm becoming black foam, rotting, bubbling on that bed. My body won't even be buried beneath the ground. Where do they move my bones? Mm -hmm. Probably in the dump. They just dumped it in the garbage. I don't know. It's in the trash. Along with the rest of you. Wake up in the morning, opening a window. Feel the warm rays of the sun. The scent of the season that brings the morning breeze. Oh, I miss those old days. I don't even know if it's night or day now. All that remains is that candle light. But I hate that light. Because it makes everyone see how bad my condition is. Whenever I wake up and see that another one of us has died. Their bodies has carried away and new patients take their place. I want to go back to my old life. I want to go back. I want to go back. I heard that someone has been left behind in that staircase. Poor soul. Staircase. Hmm. There's only one way to be born, but in how many ways can you die? And while suffering from this sickness, I really wonder, is it better to have these candles lit or extinguished? Hmm. If you want to see things in reverse, Look from the opposite point of view. Eventually, you'll see your fate in a different light. Okay, this is a lot of hints for something, but I'm not sure what the, the it's a hints for. Extinguishing candles, reverse point of view. Um, hmm. Not sure. Over here. Oh, there's a save point here as well. Room for these again. I guess I'll go through them. A black lily consumed by the spell is a sign of the curse. If you hold it in your hand, it will lead you into the abyss. A black lily, eh? Hmm. The white lily that witnesses the demise is a sign of the innocence. The night brightens and the dawn comes. Hmm. 
That's in blue. These words, there's something about them that I don't like. Why? Feels like a divination. Oh. Divinations don't work that way. Sweet temptress, what path will you take? The path of the pins or the path of the needles? Make two offerings and the divine protection will be granted upon you. You're on the path of needles, by the way. However, the divine protection is still missing. So? Uh, maybe... Maybe it's about choosing between the easy way and the hard way? I'm not sure about it, but I know that people who overcome hardships will mature sooner. I didn't have any hardships, but my trauma brought me to my limits. Well, you're happy that we met, aren't you? Are we? I don't know. If, if I didn't meet you, I wouldn't be in this mess in the first place. <laughs> I just kind of went the other way. You'd be taken by the ghosts, and I would just be at home. Hmm. Half the pins, half the needles. Make two offerings. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. If only I had been sent to prison before all that started. There are cards in here. Only diamonds are missing the deck. Spades are swords, hearts are chalices, clubs are wands and rods and diamonds. Uh, what are the diamonds supposed to uh, symbolize? Hmm, maybe we should find something further that somehow, somehow related to diamonds. Further? Lady, what are you... Oh well, you're always like that. I learned it from my grandma. She told me about the moon phases, constellations, fairy tales, and also medicinal herbs. Hmm, medicinal herbs? My grandmother and my mother were, were growing herbs, and they concocted various ointments. Your family. As much as I want to, it's impossible to bring back mine. Hmm. Yeah, because he said, I think in the beginning he said something about his his family related to like an accident or something, maybe? I can't remember. I wish I could choose the way I had to be buried. Did you look at it one more time? At your offering. Your gift to this land. A tower without a way in and out. Just like this place. So many beautiful butterflies. I can't wait to become as beautiful as them. Butterflies. I heard that souls can change their form and appear as butterflies. Maybe it's actually true. I remember seeing a lot of them flying around her. Her? You mean that girl who drove us here? Uh-huh. Oh, so did you also see them back when she chased us? No, I haven't. So they know each other. Just as I thought. But I really don't get why those butterflies gather around her. Gather. I wonder how she's connected to this place. Hmm. Footsteps in the background. Good. See the game? Let me do this. This is like you can't can't go get past because it's a wire. Oh boy. Uh well, let me get this first though. What's this? I don't want to touch it, but you're from the central room. We're going to do a treasure hunt all together, and each room will have a purpose. Okay. Oh god. Um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. I don't know if you need to remember this. Hmm. Okay. Look at these drawers. I assume these are drawers. The world of the living, the world of those who once were alive, the world of those who once were humans. All of them are interconnected, but all of them are absolutely different from each other. Which world do you belong to? At first glance, only this world exists, but there are actually three of them. Oh, did you just know that, I guess? Just three of them? Overlapping each other, making up one big world. I suppose that girl is in the other world right now. <sighs> hmm, interesting. It was a dialogue choice. Who cares which world she's in? You heard it? A door opened. She'll be here in this room right now. But it's a little difficult to pass to our world, so I think we're safe for now. Hmm? Then which world are we in right now? Come on, let's go! <laughs> okay, uh, don't worry about it. Good. Nothing here? Traitor, 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 traitor! Nothing in there. Nothing in there. Oh. Soon we'll be together. Death has separated us. Death will unite us. A photo. Only half of it. Hmm. I'm still alive. How are you? Don't come to me. I beg you. You'll get infected. Please run away from here. To a safe place. Your safety is most important to me. Letters. 
A lashy is too old and barely legible, though. A photograph, perhaps? All this time, they were purifying us, warring off the evil spirits. Despite that, we keep dying. Who would have thought I'd be an object of exorcism? I had so much to do. I left behind so many things near dear to me. That girl with fluffy hair says she would take me someplace nice. How much longer? How much longer? I wonder, is there any place worse than here? Okay, I guess that's it. I assume these are just the supernatural thoughts of the dead people who were quarantined in the plague and there's left to die, I guess. Hmm. What do I do now, though? I'm not sure. There's that weird amulet. Can I... Or is, I don't know if it was an amulet, but like a trinket, was it? Or something? We saw something around here. Oh, it's, it's glowing now. I wonder what happened to the owner of this amulet. Wait, there's something in the shadow of that pile of rubble. Did somebody hide it here? It's a box. I can't open it. There's something stuck inside. If only I could find something to move it aside through the small gap. Or maybe there's a tool for cutting wires inside. That'd be helpful. I'm pretty sure there is. I got a toolbox. Hmm, something fell out. A note? I was absolutely certain I shut the door tight, but they're coming. Countless sounds coming from my pursuers, just before closing the door on the staircase. Run, 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 run away, away from here, away! Run, run, run! You can't get away, you can't get away, you can't get away! No one can escape from death. I wonder what he's running from. At any rate, we need to figure out how to open this toolbox. Talisman. We don't pick up the talisman, though. We do have a toolbox, however, but we can op we, we need to find a way to open it? Hmm. Well, the game said something, mentioned something about a central room, which I assume is here, and we can look at the things we saw before in the central room. I assume here. A treasure hunt. I'm not sure what that indicates. I see a cross in the middle, so maybe it's in a room of a cross. Like in the in the top middle anyway. Hmm. Oh, no, no, oops. Box. Okay, we did get a box. How to open the box? And then open a door? I assume the, the, the wire. You open the box so they can open the door. And the door, and you snuff the candles, and then you find a map. I don't know. What's this? Huh? Isn't there something shiny on this clock? I'll check it out. How do we get it? Oh, there we go. That's it. The needle's thin and pretty sturdy. We could use it to open that toolbox. Maybe you could slightly move the tools stuck inside of it. Hmm, okay, I guess. Oh, it's open. Okay, now we can use the tools in the toolbox. Good. Amazing. Which I assume they mentioned that it could cut the wire, right? So we can use that to cut the wire, maybe. I'll do just that. La 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 la. It's over here. Save the game again. I don't know. <laughs> it's ominous. This is, you save the game right here. Maybe you could use that toolbox we found earlier. It's a little rusty, but it looks usable enough. There you go. Oh, we can't open it yet. <sighs> Another key search. Hey Kai, this doesn't look like it has a keyhole to begin with. Huh? So it needs a password then. That said, how do you know that? Well, I don't know. Uh, somehow. Maybe it opens with some other method? Not a key, not a password. What method could that be? Not sure. Well, the door is locked. How do I open the door? I don't know. Hmm. And now that I, okay, because there's, there's a list of instructions that said, like, how to open the door, how to open the key, whatever. And there's also this picture with numbers. I think I get it now, okay. You, you see a number seven? You see, okay, these are related. I, I, I didn't get it until now. But you see number seven says, you are here. And you find number seven. You are here. I guess that's we. Well, I don't know. I guess that's where we found the map. I assume because we're in the central room, so number seven is the one where we found the 
the uh, the key. So this is like a hint to like how to go through the steps, I guess. So how to open the door would be number three. So we'd go to number three to figure out how to open the door, which is to the right of that over there. Hmm. Apparently it's over there to the right. Um. Hmm. Open the doors to the right. So like, I don't know, actually, we'll see, I guess. Is it over here, was it? Was it over here or the other one? It mentioned something about password, right? I think. 12B10 or whatever. 12B10. Wait, that's, I mean, then again, the door doesn't need a password, right? What did it need? I don't know. <laughs> Let me look at it again. The map. Three. Sins keep piling up. Also, somebody opened the door, I think, in the background. Some more ghosts. Some people believe in reincarnation, and some believe in nothingness after death. Some believe in heaven and hell, and some don't believe in any gods. Every one of us thinks differently. However, nobody other of us can escape the moment of passing away. And when this time comes to us, I wonder how will it be? My hollow corpse shall be another offering this earth. A lot of ominous messages, by the way. I'm a little... A little, little, little too much. A little too much, just random ominous messages. A bowl in a big casket. The last key is inside of Pandora's box. That's the hope all of us keep clinging to. Just like the sinners clung to the spire's thread. However, outside of the box there is... I don't know, there's something. Longer, 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 longer. Try to make it four times longer, then hang it down. Okay. Tie it just like Rapunzel with her hair. Hmm. You seem to be the seeing is believing type. That's the impression I get from you, at least. Blind belief in things that don't exist is pretty much the same as dreaming instead of waking up. Right. Now one day you have to awaken from your dream. Or make it reality. Make it reality, you say. I really wish all this was just a dream. I mean, in dreams, you can change everything as you like, right? Who knows? Maybe you could even bring back the days when everything was still fine. All right, let me think. In that case, I'd like to become a nurse. I work in the theater and get married and... <laughs> and by the way, who would you like to be, Kai? Uh, well, a pianist. Even though you're clumsy? I told you already that Jim fell off in his own. <laughs> oh, but why did I give up on my dream? I'd like to hear your performance someday, if you don't mind. And Kai was a pianist. He liked playing piano. You wonder to whom belong all the notes. The answer is to all of us here. You can't hear us singing here. Thus I'll call you to come closer so you can finally hear our song. Don't worry. Soon you'll be able to sing too. Okay. You'll kill us too, I guess. Hmm. Let me find anything here. They mentioned the rope, by the way. Connect the rope. Make it four times longer, but I don't think we can do that right now. It seems. How do I open the door? Oh, what's this? A drawing of a four-leaf clover. A drawing of a family, parents with children, a sketchy drawing of a rainbow. Is that important? Just tiny sheets of paper, just drawings. Hmm. I thought we might find something useful in these drawers, but there's too many of them. Yeah. Maybe we should split up. What? You're joking, right? Hmm, interesting. There's a choice. Uh... Hmm. This is, like, important. Uh... It's too dangerous or stay close to me? Yeah, let's split up, gang. This is, like, a horrible idea, I feel like, but... Sure, let's split up, gang. If you inspect the other room in the meantime... Never mind, sorry, it's a really bad idea. Okay, we're not splitting up. It's like every horror movie. You split up and you instantly die. Hmm. Something dripping over here. That's, that's weird. Water droplets? Perhaps there was a bathroom here. Oh, something fell. What's this? Isn't that a snuffer? A tool for extinguishing candles. I'll take this with me. Huh? Don't even think about using it. We honestly don't want to huddle in the darkness here. Well, this thing is kind of cute, isn't it? She doesn't listen for even a second. Maybe I should just let her have it. 
Okay, I got a snuffer. It did, it did mention the note, something about a snuffer, I guess. There's a lot of leaking around. <laughs> so much leaking. Is water or is it blood? Because I can't tell now, because I see some red droplets too. <laughs> yeah. Oh well. Oh. More ghosts? Good. This extinguishes. Told you not to. But it'd be harder for her to find us, don't you think? Or oh, whatever. Because I'm thinking maybe 12 become 10 or whatever? Oh. <laughs> Scary. So we snuff these candles. Maybe that's what you're supposed to do? 12 becomes 10? And maybe there was 10 candles? Or... I don't know. Well, I wonder why this one isn't lit. Yeah, that, that one isn't lit for some reason. What happens if I just snuff all the candles? Can I just snuff all the candles? Just whispers, good. Ah, uh, might be a bad idea. If I whistle, if I snuff all the candles, then the ghosts would just come and kill me, I feel like. Oshio, I, I just hear whispering. Alright, I'm gonna just snuff all the candles, because I'm a maniac. Yep. Just get the, let the ghosts just kill me, I guess. It's a horrible idea. But I've run out of ideas, so I'm gonna I only have this one. Only, I only have this idea left. Snuff all of the candles. All of them. All of them, I say. I'm gonna get killed, most likely. Any candles over here? No. Just thinking maybe if I, if I turn off all the candles, maybe that would open the door? <laughs> Or something. Turn off all the candles. Turn off all the candles. The only thing that's protecting us from the monsters. La 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 la. Which I assume. I don't know if that's the case exactly, but I assume it's... That's, that's the case. You know, instinctively, you don't want to turn off the candles, but... Oh, hands, good. Yeah, hands. There you go. <laughs> all right, I'm in. I turn. I, I basically turn off all the candles, and then the hands start chasing me. And then I can go in this door. Good. All right. Okay. Hmm. Go that way. Oh. Oh. Okay. I'm stuck there. Can I go down? Oh no, it's locked. What the hell's going on? Okay, well now, yeah, we're kind of stuck. Uh, we're here again. I'm a little tired. Can we rest a bit? Oh, sure. Thanks. Hey, will you save me from now on? Um, I don't know. Who are, I don't, I, we j again, we just met. Um, no, uh, how do I put this? Oh, I see. Thank you for trying to cheer me up, but... When you say like that, someone might misunderstand. Yay, you're finally smiling. I'm sorry. All this time, I didn't notice that you were concerned about me. That's okay, because now I know you aren't mad at me. Mad? All this time, you seem to be brooding over something. <laughs> you know, like a brooding main character. I was really worried that I've upset you. That's why I'm happy now. Right. Coming here, that's the way I was. Never attaching any importance to anything. Things I like to try something, and things I can only do right now. So many things I could do, and time is always limited, and yet I've postponed them to the very end. Besides, and now that I've reached the point of no return, I have to decide which road to choose. But I don't know where to go, unsure whether the circumstances will crush me one day. That's why I had to handle this situation by myself, because I'm the only one who could, I could rely on. It was too painful, so I averted my eyes and stopped going forward. But I'm alright now. If I won't advance, I'll regret it. And I got the courage to move on from a friend that reassured me. But if you hadn't stopped, you wouldn't have realized what's really important to you, right? Yeah. Alright, let's get back on track. And keep going through these doors that lead nowhere. <laughs> yeah, it's just, yeah, okay. Oh, oh, actually we ended over here. Is this? Kai, what's wrong? Oh, never mind, it's nothing. 
What is that pulling sensation? Hmm. Strange. Strange. Anyone here? No, oh, it's locked. Here, this is the door that acquired a key. The promise, huh? Okay, then let's find it. You're awfully positive about that. Well, that is the wrong attitude to have. Whichever obstacles are in your way, you need to find out how to keep moving forward. What's wrong? We've searched all over the place and still haven't found the key. That means there's only one place left we didn't check. And why are you looking at me like that? Do you really want to go down there? Since we found, since we found some ropes earlier, I think it's possible to climb down and we t tie them together. Alright, that means this hole right here. The translation, by the way, I don't know, it seems a little off for some reason. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just me. It's slightly just kind of weird <laughs> because they, they say, like, the promise? What do you mean promise? Promise what? I don't know, anyway. I'll go down alone. What about me? I want you to hide nearby and wait for me. Huh? We have two lanterns, so everything will be fine. And the rope tears, uh, you'll be able to help me, that's why. If anything happens while I'm still down there, just leave me and run away. Again, by myself? Do you really have to go down? I don't want to, but there's no other way. But if it won't come back, please don't leave me. Good grief. Yare yare. Here's a scarf. <laughs> okay, just just put on the scarf on her. Good. Just plaster her on. It's like, a, it's like in Photoshop, you know, just add a new layer. Just put it on. Literally on her. Fluffy. But are you sure I can have it? Yeah. I don't want to get stuck somewhere along the way. Well, I'm off then. Wee. Yes, I realized that I'll just end up hurting you. What does that mean? It's ominous. 